Hello, Mr. Jackson. My friend Steve here would like to put some upgrades on you. Would you like that? I said yes, Steve. What have we got to start off? A heat FS shell with 305mm as a pen. Good. What's next? A roof. Oh, okay. That's a bit of an odd choice, Steve, but wait. What was that? Did you put an anime in a tank? I don't care what Mike Goes Women Giant Waffle says. If it says Ubu or Ayaya one time, I'm gonna have it put down. Sent that man back to Berlin. He just pulled forward a tiny bit, dude. Thank you. I'm glad you were listening. Awesome. Shit. Whoa! Loading heat. Drive our gunner. We're getting pushed rather aggressively now. Oblivious mobile. Oh, a T-34 got me from the other side. Hi guys, and welcome back to the channel. If you enjoyed that intro, please remember to hit the like button. It helps out the channel massively. And if you're enjoying those goofy little intros combined with the action intros, uh, let me know in the comments box below. Now today we're playing one of my favourite tanks in the game, the Jackson. Except this Jackson is very different. Extremely different actually, multiple different types of changes. Uh, most noticeably though, it has a roof. Not with much armour though, but oopsie daisies. It will definitely stop most MG rounds from strafing out your crew, just not 50 kills. Of course, it's still technically open, so you're victim to overpressure from things with fire HE, but that's not really a big issue. This tank really depends on its mobility and its firepower and its gun handling, and it has all of that. Also, a rather weird change, uh, it's got a machine gun in the hull, which the other Jackson doesn't have. But the next change is what you probably clicked on the video for. Uh, this thing is a heat FS shell. 305mm of penetration, much like the Italian version of the M36 based on the Sherman chassis. Uh, I much prefer the Jackson chassis though. It's much more stable, less armour of course, but not as tall. Armour wise, all round it's pretty pathetic as you'd expect from a tank destroyer based on the US Jackson. Uh, but the manlet is omega trolley. This thing bounces shots probably <laughs> like it shouldn't, but it is there. Now, I personally think the Jackson is one of the most underrated tank destroyers in War Thunder. This 90mm that fires the shell. Look at this APHE. Good grief. M82 shot uh, 140 grams of TNT, uh, which is a lot. 105mm of pen. It will easily overmatch the side armor on Panthers, etc. And now, for big old King Tigers, you've got a EFS shell. This thing can pretty much do it all. Just don't get hit. <laughs> That's the mantra of this guy. On top of all this, it has great zoom, like very good zoom for taking out long range targets and of course, a 50 cal on top for those pesky light tanks, open tops and aeroplanes. I had a lot of fun in this thing, I hope you guys enjoy this video, there's a lot of kills to go through. Right dude, we're on a fat old up here, what have we got? We're with Russia and UK, USA against Germany, Italy, Italy's scary dude. We're absolutely hoofing it on the snow though. Don't see anything up top yet. It's already shouldn't happening. One of them just got disintegrated. That's a tiger. Two tigers. Three dead up there already. I don't know why anyone goes up there. Definitely scares the bejesus out of me. I heard machine gun fire from up there. MG 34, so oh, here we go. I got a Panther, what are you? You were a Panther. Yeah, I want to get down over here for now. You seem to be all on the A side now. Oh, bye. -bye. I don't know where he's gone. I think he's directly behind this tiger. Somebody else shot him though. I can't tell if he's reversing back or not. Oh hey, this guy's just de-rendered here. Flag bus. Oh, hit my heat, right? He's straight up vanished for a sec. There he is. Good little bit of overpressure. 
Stop them showing me from over that way, right? So he's scouted. Hunter D. Oh, M18's gone for a... A ride on the ice. You can't move on that very fast. So far, so good. The Panther still isn't dead yet, right? Yeah, no, he's not. I don't have an assist for him yet. You can see our Panther now. Oh, too low. Just right. Loading here. Looks like a Dicker Max or something. Where did he go? Stir a meal. And now the other guy has peeked his head out is fighting my T-34-85. This thing's very cool, dude. Is that... I love the Jackson. It's one of my favourite tanks. So to give this thing a EFS and not have a serious penalty of like a super high BR is is very welcome. No gunner, but I did think it was horizontal. He's making a run for it, dude. Oh, we might be dead here. BFW. I loaded heat again to deal with the VFW, but... Oh, he's pushing. It's because he knew the plane was there, right? And I think there's still another one up. Another tank running about me, probably. I don't have to move, therefore I will not, right? Actually, I do. I need to get the B. Come on, Riffy boy. Well, that's not a nice thing to call this. Like a dangerous manoeuvre. It's a Porsche Tiger. Oh! Okay, back to ABHE, I think. Enemy planes are inbound. Well, the tracers are incredibly difficult to see now. Oh, there are so many planes coming in. I'm smoking a little bit. Well, we're about to see if a roof does anything magical. Okay, I got one plane. That one guy back there doesn't look so good. Reloading then. Okay. Oh, we got a kill. He pinned me. We got a kill assist on him. After I put a shell through his fuselage. We are taking B. I'm going to play a wee bit more risky here. Oh, that's not good. Okay, he missed me. So a Wurble and a tank fired at me. There's a tank there. Really poor shot. I'm gonna load heat again. Just in case the Wurble wants to have a go at me. I can see his roof actually. Bounced a shot from someone and I don't know where it came from. Getting low again. Awesome, another tiger. Right. Back to APHE. This is intense. 
I got find those mods down there. Good fight, dude. It's a good fight. That was a really bad shot by me, but it's all right. That tiger still isn't dead, is he? The one is behind me in the field. And we've most certainly got this panther pushing up. I think he's repairing though. Tiger and a panther F. These guys are not having a good time. Is he going to try and help repair this one? Oh, he's back there. Good. One more to deal with, I think. Right, hide before the wobble comes. I love this thing, dude. I love it so much. It's so good. This is like this tank is like me. Like a th this is it. No, I got a heat. Maybe it's too low up here. I don't know, but it's uh, it's very good. Thirteen kills. Mike three's coming in for a dive. A wee swoop. Is that a little stug? Dangerous boy. I think that's going to be us though. There we go, dude. Love this thing. Oh, damn it. <laughs> oh, there's another one here. Okay, starting guys. Let's see what you're in store for us. Yes, Russia, France. Wow. Great sound engine, Gaijin. Makes no engine sound, then all of a sudden explodes into life. Let me try this one. No IS in for you. There's an enemy in this corner. Uh oh. He wasn't paying attention at least. Another big hole. Oh. Thank you, teammate. If that did fire us, we'll get him. That guy can see my roof. The Panther D's pushed. Bill Dog just ate doo doo. Here we go. I need this Panther D to make a little manoeuvre. I also need to get rid of this artery fire. But yeah, I think I'm relatively safe to get around here now and not get bombarded. Um, driving into the unknown now. See you later, Jumborino. And there's another Sherman behind. Okay, it's time to load heat. Two jumbos coming out of spawn. Some sort of tank destroyers here.
engine rod Oh, it's the BTR. Oh, he'll rip me to shreds. I think that teammate just shot him though. Oh. Awesome. A slow the APHE for this lad. Reversing. Loading heat again. Right, they all seem to be coming out of there. Oh, that's their- I thought their spawn on this side. That is their spawn. What is that? Is this 43? No, it's an M19. Oh! What a tank, dude. This thing is very good. We got, like, the tools to deal with lots of stuff. It's not a very good map layout. And nine kills, dude. Farming. That's funny there's an enemy in our spawn. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Clapped. Where'd he go? He made a run for it. My man's made a run for it, dude. He's dead. Well, GG, double ace, I'll take that. So the M36B2 is in, oh, it's an awesome tank. This thing is an absolute beast. It can pretty much handle any situation whatsoever, except the usual stuff about being bombed or being shot once. Uh, but there's a really sad thing about it. In the tech tree, unless you own the premium Tiger, there's no other 5.7s, uh, which is really sad. You could take the Bulldog in this, but they both kind of fulfill the same role now and for backups you've got a Chiri too which is not great please Gaijin add more 5.7 Japanese stuff to bring out and line up with this thing it is too good to just sit there on its own as always I'd like to thank everyone over on Discord and Patreon for supporting me over there you guys are awesome uh, to all the tier 3s to get a shout out over on Discord first that's GG bruh thank you very much dude Toast McGee Ross, Bofi, Calvino, Destari, Gifted, Greed, Jamie, Marushin, Melly Mouse, Stoyan, and The Reformation, and to everyone else over on Patreon as well. That is, of course, Sickness Win, Matthew S, Buke the Tactical Broccoli, Eric Fear, Jesse Mills, The Tackle Guy, Watermelon, Ar I don't know, Understomped, Archangel, Ari, Brahma Nation, Sexy, Ethan, Excavation Nation, Gifted, Greed, Handsome, Tatia, Kin, Assault Lord, Coil, Metany, Pickle Pirate, Ralph, Rage, Tectonic, The Reformation, Trash Panda, TV2000, Atomic, Varian, Warpig, Shaft, Alicia, Mortanen, Stoyan, J Tormy, Shmoo, and Stuart Netherton. And to everyone still here, thank you very much for watching. Much love and bye-bye.